Hello, my name is Lauren Monahan, Program Specialist with the Division of Waste Management. As the holidays draw nearer, we tend to see an increase in materials that residents need to dispose of. So I'm here today to t give you a few tips and tricks to help you set out your containers and your materials properly to ensure that you're serviced in an efficient manner. Here we're next to a Herbie, and this Herbie is set out correctly. Um, you can set your Herbie out as well as your Rosie and your Lenny anytime after 4 p.m. the day before your day of service. So you want to pull your Herbie all the way to the curb just as this one is and you want to make sure that your Herbie or any of your other containers is at least three feet away from any object or other containers that you're setting out. So this Herbie is at least three feet away from both the mailbox and the tree that's behind me. Now here at this residence, we've got a Herbie as well as a Rosie. This Rosie is a little too close to the light pole. So what we're gonna do is move it over here to make sure that it's in a place that's extremely serviceable for the truck. So here, the Rosie has plenty of clearance for the automatic arm on the truck to reach down and grab it without damaging light poles, trees, or mailboxes. We want to make sure to be able to service your Rosie quickly and efficiently without damaging any property. Now when you set your container on the curb, you want to make sure to set it out facing the right direction. This Rosie is placed correctly on the curb. Your handles want to be closest to the residents. This is incorrectly set out. When residents set their containers out this way, trash, materials, debris, recycling, yard waste, what have you, tends to fall out of the container before it reaches inside the truck. Some other materials that you may find you need to set out, especially around the holidays, are not only yard waste material, but also extra cardboard boxes if you have those around your residence. Cardboard boxes, um, if you have a lot of those, you'll want to break those down, bundle them, and then set them right next to your recycling rosy container. If you have yard waste, you can place that in your Lenny container, the gray container, or you can also pick up free yard waste bags with the coupons that are mailed out to you and then you can load that yard waste into the bags and set that directly next to your Lenny or on the curb and those will be also picked up. Make sure not to place your yard waste in any sort of plastic bag as that material is not compostable and we won't be able to service that from the curb. If you need extra yard waste coupons, you can always call LexCall at 311 and request those to be mailed to your residents. You can also pick those up in person from LexCall. One last thing about cart set out, an important thing to remember is if you have excess bulky materials, please do not set those on top of your container. Uh, we want to make sure that any bulky item is set next to the container because that will affect the service of your container. Make sure if you have any vehicles that you regularly park on the street that you're not blocking your containers the night before or the morning of your service because we don't want to damage your vehicle so we're very careful. If the container is near a vehicle it won't be serviced because we want to make sure not to damage your vehicle. The Division of Waste Management sends four trucks to your neighborhood every single week. The four trucks being the Herbie truck to service your trash, the Rosie truck that services your recycling, the Lenny truck that services your yard waste, and then an overflow truck that picks up any excess or bulky items that are set on the curb. Mattresses, appliances, and tires, uh, just call LexCall and then they'll put in a special call for that because we have different trucks that service those specific items. If you have any questions about cart set out um, or any general questions for the Division of Waste Management, please call LexCall at 311 or 425-2255.